This is the the D mic. About my daily driver microphone. The big gun. Legendary. The sure. SM7. The most professional grade mic. Obviously. I always wanted. My favorite musicians. My favorite YouTubers. My favorite podcasters. Everybody has this microphone. To be honest, I think this microphone, a lot of people love it because it just stands out. I don't think it's about the sound. Yes, let's admit, the microphone really, really sounds good. But if you go ahead and actually get any cinema camera or a red camera and use it in one of the highest cinematic profiles like vlog or prores between me and you videographers if you don't know how to color grade actually your footage is going to look really really flat worse than any other standard normal camera same thing goes with this microphone the sure sm7b i've actually heard a lot of people saying this is not me don't quote me on this but if you don't know what you're doing the sure sm7b is actually going to sound really standard and basic that's why i actually watch a lot of youtubers a lot of people have it they look good on camera but the microphone or their sound actually sounds standard my sm7b being a waste of money but guess what there's one thing that still attracts me the look the microphone is so nice looks nice it's just so slick it gives you the feeling you just want to have it in front of you i feel like you're podcasting even if you're not a podcaster this microphone was well designed that's why it became popular in my opinion people who cannot justify paying four or five hundred dollars and add an extra interface because don't get me wrong this is an xlr microphone so you're gonna need an extra interface to be able to connect it to your computer on the top of that if you're not getting the roadcaster pro 2 because it's out you actually have to get a cloud lifter because the microphone is super game hungry and that makes the cost actually go even higher so if you're not ready to spend that kind of money what do you do probably gonna go with another brand that will make something that will look like the sure sm7b even sure themselves they actually realized that everybody couldn't afford the sure sm7b that's why they came up with the mv7 with the usb which means you could actually connect this microphone straight to your computer but what if somebody actually thought about making exactly almost exactly the same thing and give it a usb port and make it actually a dynamic microphone that will sound almost like the sure sm7b that will actually solve the problem and today i actually have one here the fafan k 658 so take a look this is the box this is everything that you get in the box you're getting the user guide a super super nice usb type c this shock mount that we're gonna be talking about in a moment and some other accessories obviously to be able to attach a microphone and the last thing this is the d microphone this is what it looks like almost like the sure sm7b and i believe these guys were actually going after the sure sm7b this is a dynamic usb microphone check that's perfect so we're gonna go ahead and actually put it together this is what the microphone looks like guys obviously it comes with this little stand that i'm actually using on this other microphone i like the volume button the top of the microphone actually really really looks like the shoe sm7b and i really really love the design i love the sound of it by the way i'm just gonna let you guys listen to the sound of it right now you're listening to the fafine k658 microphone it has like a built-in eq if i go ahead and actually uh, add the volume let's say this is the maximum volume right now i'm not clipping even if i get closer to the microphone pa -pa -pa no clipping this is the maximum volume I have a crazy fan going on right now so i can actually stay quiet for you guys to get the noise level if you are in a noisy environment this will be actually a perfect microphone so this is another clip with some effects applied to the microphone i just added a little bit of bass in my voice the microphone is already bassy enough i just if you want that radio 
host kind of deep voice and then you can add a little bit of eq maybe don't play with eq that much now this is usb again which is super cool you have a headphones jack which means you can plug in your headphones we have rgb so a way you can actually have some rgb going on if you're a gamer this is gonna be super super awesome and i love this button here you can actually tap to wait and it's going to actually mute or unmute the microphone which is even super super awesome because the sure sm7b obviously doesn't have that i'm super happy with everything about this microphone but there's one thing that i'm not happy about and is this thing here it's not working this shock mount I don't care if it does the job, not talking about that, but it's the design. It was almost perfect. Just change it, man. Like remove this thing here. This part has to be changed. You need to add a small section here and you need to move the USB port and headphones port somewhere here. Make it look nice and clean and that should be the next Shure FM7B. See, I even gave you a name. It's Shure FM7B. So guys, if you like this video, please make sure you hit that subscribe button and like. My name is Sam and I see you on my next video. Take care.